An illegal immigrant in the murder of Kate Steinle back in court yet again today. Jose Zarate said to be sentenced for his conviction on possession of the gun that killed her. Will he walk free or will he be deported? Claudia Cowens live in San Francisco back on this story yet again. Good morning. Good morning to you, Bill. Jose Garcia Zarate will not walk. He will be sentenced to time served for being a felon in possession of a firearm, and then his case will move to the federal court where he will have a very well-known lawyer. Now, the felony gun conviction was the only conviction to come out of his trial in November. The jury decided Kate Steinle's death, the result of a ricochet bullet, was an accident. The defense has filed a motion to get that one conviction dismissed, arguing Garcia Zarate didn't know he had a gun in his hand until it discharged, and then he tossed it into the bay. Public defender Matt Gonzalez says the judge should have instructed the jurors that a momentary possession of a firearm does not meet the requirement for a conviction. The judge will likely deny that motion to dismiss today, and the defense has promised to appeal. Meantime, Garcia Zarate will soon be turned over to U.S. Marshals to face new immigration and weapons charges in federal court, charges his defense team claim are nothing more than a reaction by government officials who are upset over his acquittal of murder and assault. Garcia Zarate will be represented by famed civil rights attorney Tony Serra, who has made a career out of fighting the federal government. According to a statement from the public defender's office, quote, it is expected that Sarah will seek to have the new charges dismissed based on double jeopardy concerns and the Trump administration's politically motivated vindictive prosecution, end quote. Garcia Zarate could be arraigned in federal court as early as next week. If convicted, he could face up to 10 more years in federal prison. And as for Kate Steinle's family, Bill, they have kept a very low profile since the verdict, and they are not expected here at court here wow. today. We'll follow it. Thank you. Claudia Cowan, live in the streets of San Francisco there. Thank you.